Welcome to another video. We are gonna take a look at an animated sketch on top of this elliptic trainer. So to get started, I will unhide this sketch. We're gonna see that this will be the stick man created using sketch profiles. If I'm gonna double click on sketch one, we're gonna see that the sketch constraint will look like this. And this also can be animated. So if you're gonna look at the bottom, over here we're gonna have this angle. If we want to animate, we're gonna make use of animate constraint within Katia V5 sketch. Afterwards, I'm gonna click on the angle because this will be animated. And we're gonna have the first value will be zero degrees. The last value will be 360. Afterwards, we're gonna have the number of steps for the animation. If I will uh, go with something like 10, and I will have the animation put on repeat. I will slightly position the animate constraint over here so we can also see this and also uh, the sketch behind. We're gonna have the possibility to run that. So run animation and we're gonna see the stickman animated on this elliptic trainer. Now this allows us to quickly see let's say a rapid movement. In this case, we see the 2D profile position on top of the elliptic trainer. And uh, if this moves too fast, we can add additional steps. So over here, number of steps, I'm gonna add 100. I'm gonna go run the animation from the start and I'm gonna start this again. And the animation should play, so I also press the stop animation. And now we can see that animated sketch in full motion. So I hope that you like this content. I will also define other animated sketches, starting from, um, let's say, defining the sketches, adding the constraints, and afterwards having those simulated. If you like this kind of content, I will also position a similar video over here to the left and to the right a subscribe button so consider to subscribe if you want more content like this thanks for watching